Have you ever had customers or employees ask if you have a mobile application? And maybe you don't, maybe you just have a website today. There's several different ways to be able to take functionality of your website or your web application and make it available on mobile. On one end of the spectrum, we have websites that feature mobile responsiveness. There's nothing fancy about it, it just operates in your browser, but it accommodates different screen sizes. Almost all modern website platforms should have some degree of mobile responsiveness. On the other end of the spectrum, you have native mobile applications. These are written in code and can be deployed specifically for an individual platform like Android or iOS. This usually costs a lot of money because you're managing different versions of the same application. Now, software employs a technique called progressive web application or PWA. This gives you kind of the best of both worlds. It feels more like a native mobile application, but it's really easy to deploy. You don't have to maintain different versions of your web application and a mobile application. Hi, I'm Dan Lehman from Automation Health helpers.com and we're software implementation partners. If you haven't gotten started with software, you can do so for free using the link in the description below. Let's say you just built a really awesome web application with software and you have this event coming up and people who are attending your event want to be able to download an app to have on their phones to show them what their schedule is. To get started with the PWA functionality, you can click on settings and then go ahead and click on mobile app. The first thing that we can do is enable our mobile app PWA functionality with this toggle, and then we need an app name. We can also give it a short name, which will show up in certain locations. Next, we need to upload an icon for our app. This should be 512 by 512 pixels. And for a last step, we can add a color that matches our branding here. Now, by default, we can display a little icon on our website to indicate that people should download our application. I'm gonna keep mine on the right-hand side and I'm gonna display it both on mobile and on desktop. So this is something that not only works on mobile, but could also work on Chrome on your desktop as well. Go ahead and press save and you'll need to make sure to publish your changes as well. Now to show you what it looks like from the user's perspective, I'm currently on my Android phone looking at this website. Of course, we could have our own custom domain that we deploy this to, but I just have this running as a test right now on this Barbara 8569. You'll notice as I'm looking at the application that I've got this icon in the lower right-hand corner. This indicates that I can download this app. So let's give it a try and see what it looks like. You'll see that this is asking our permission to be able to install it. We'll go ahead and click install. Now that we've installed the application, we can go ahead and open it up. We see this nice little icon for my event and I can click and open this up. Here's our splash screen using that color that we added. And here is now our app. It feels nice and smooth as we're going through it. We've got that nice navigation that expands. So you're gonna get that feeling of being on a native mobile application, but really it's this PWA. Now your users will be able to easily see the schedules on their phones and they can click and open up the events to learn more about what's happening during their day. Harness the power of software's applications, be it for web or for mobile. Get started with software today by using the link in the description below.